Hi, I'm Julie Matier from Marketing O'Clock, and today we're going to go through budget scripts and how you can use them to manage larger accounts or multiple budgets. So to start, if you have an account that say has a bunch of different budgets, but it's in the same account. So maybe you're targeting different countries and each country has a different budget or you're targeting different cities and they want to have a specific budget for each city. It can get really hard to manage that in Google ads or especially if you don't have a report that's constantly pulling this data in. So we have a really easy solution to this and all you need is a budget script, labels on your campaigns and an automated role in the account. So to start with the script, this is typically what it looks like. The only thing that you would need to change in this is the max spend that you want. And essentially what this is saying, if we look at this top block here, is any ads that have the label active on them and then any ads that have the label with the budget that you specifically want. So if you have a budget that is only for the US, maybe label it budget US. This can be called anything you want it to be. And then you have the max spend of what it's allowed to spend each day right here. And then you can break that down for the different locations you want. Again, this could be broken down any way you want it. You just have to make sure that the label is the same in here as it is as what's on your campaigns. So this is what the script will look like. That's the only thing you have to change in here and you can always preview them to make sure it's working the correct way before you actually set this up in your account. So the way that the rule comes into this is when you set this rule up, you can give it a name. So we have ours named budget script enable campaigns and then whoever owns the rule will be right here. And then the action is what you want this rule to do. So this rule is gonna enable any campaigns in the account. And then the conditions to this rule are the campaigns are either enabled or paused and they have the active label on them, which means that they need to be re-enabled if they were paused due to the budget script. And then the action here is to enable the campaigns. We typically run this overnight. So if the campaigns were to pause, they'd be paused by midnight. So we run this rule between 12 and 1 a.m. and then using data from today. So this will run each day and update based on the day's data. And then you can also get an email result if there's any errors and you just put your email in right here and it'll send you anything that went wrong when the rule ran. So then again, in order to get this specific script to work well, you need to be managing multiple budgets in the same account. You need to have the active label on any campaigns that you want to be re-enabled each day or you want the script to keep track of. And then you need to have those specific budget labels on the different campaigns that you're tracking the budgets for. Another way to use budget scripts, if you're managing a really large account that has a huge budget, if you just need to make sure it doesn't spend over its daily budget each day, but it's really hard to make sure all the labels are accurate or you know, you're making a lot of new campaigns or pausing a lot of campaigns, this is a really easy one that will just send you a warning email if your spend is getting close to what the daily spend should be. So this is actually one that we created and again, the only things you need to change in here are what your spend threshold would be. So for example, if your spend, if your daily spend would be 5,000, you wanna set the threshold a little lower so you get this warning when you're starting to get close to your actual spend. So we have this set at 3,000 and then you can put email notifications in to whoever you wanna be notified when the account reaches that 3,000 spend or whatever threshold you have set. Once you get the notification, then you can go in the accounts and lower budgets or pause things if you need to. This is a really good one just to make sure you're kind of pacing right day to day. And um, if you ever are spending or it seems like something's wrong in the account, you'll get this email and you'll be able to fix the problem quickly. Again, this is really good for large campaigns where you do have a large budget and you can just kind of make sure things are spending around where they should be and you get warned if you need to go in and lower spends or pause. If you want to use these budget scripts in your account, check out the link in the description of this video. It'll take you to a blog post that has more information about using budget scripts and you'll be able to download both of these scripts right from there. If you found this tutorial helpful, please consider checking out Marketing O'Clock. It's our weekly Friday news show where we give you all the digital marketing news that's happened in the past week. Thanks!